Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning into my page today. My name is Shayna and um, today I'm gonna do a Curlbox review. So I joined Curlbox about three months ago. Um, this is actually my second actual box. My first Curlbox, I don't know, I kind of forgot. I meant to review it, but then like just, you know, things happened and I really forgot. And um, I would probably have to use the products or like buy some products again to like really give you a full good review. Um, so I'm just gonna move on to the second box. The second box that I got, for some reason I thought that the second box that I was getting from Curlbox was going to be like Diva Curl because they also send emails, but they make sure that they send the emails so that you kind of don't know what's coming. So I have like a really, really bad habit of checking my mail, so I usually like know what's already in the box because I see it from other people's Instagrams. So I thought for some reason it was going to be Diva Curl, so when I actually checked my mail and I opened the box, I was expecting the Diva Curl, but it was African Pride and um, not Diva Curl. And not that I'm not happy to review Diva Curl, it's just that I'm not, um, like I've, I've tried some of their products and I'm not really like, you know, fond of them. But African Pride, I've actually never tried, so I was really, really excited to try this line. So I'm going to tell you guys some of my thoughts on the products that they sent me and, you know, um, just give you my honest review of what I think of the products and ultimately if you should use them. So as you can see right here, um, they sent me one, two, three, four, five, actually, actually six products. The sixth product, I don't know where it's at, but it's like a thermal heat cap. I think it's one of those... Um, ones that you have to attach to a heat dryer and I don't have one of those so it's just like over there but you guys these products though I am just like I can't believe I've been sleeping on African Pride I really had to like look them up on Instagram I wasn't even sure that I was following them so let me just go ahead and tell you guys about the pre shampoo so the pre shampoo it says that it is the moisture miracle aloe and coconut water detangle and conditioning shampoo this is going to help you minimize your um, breakage and it's for your natural coils and curls um, lately I've been doing a lot of wash and goes like you know when it gets hot out I wear a lot of wash and goes so I wear my hair like that and I don't typically like comb my hair every day obviously so it does get really tangled and it does get really matted so this pre shampoo worked perfect for me when I was um, when I was detangling my hair because typically whenever I detangle my hair prior to washing it from having a wash and go it is like the hardest thing to do I've noticed for me that like the longer my hair gets the more or wait no the longer my hair gets the less manageable it becomes so detangling my hair now that it's getting a little bit longer has really become a chore so when I use this first of all let me tell you guys it's it's gone <laughs> that's really first of all it's like completely gone but oh my god it smells so good now it's gone by the way because I used it twice um, I think I probably used too much because this could have easily lasted me for a month um, in my case it only lasted me for like two weeks but it smells like heaven I don't even know how to describe what it is it can't be the aloe and coconut water I mean that really doesn't smell like anything what is it? I don't even know. I don't know what has it smelling so good. But trust me on this one, you guys. It smells delicious. Like, and it's not an overwhelming smell either. It just smells just the perfect amount of sweet. And it's like soothing. And it just makes me so happy when I smell it. I wish it weren't gone because I really want some more. Um, the texture of it is like a gel consistency. Uh, it's really smooth though. It's really like butter. I, I mean, that's like the best way that I can describe it for the hair. It literally just like melts into my hair. And so any tangles that I have, it just melts in there and it gets the tangles right out. So, I mean, with that, I definitely see myself buying this again. Um, I'm going to have to look into where this is sold at because I want this like ASAP. Before I do another wash and go, I'm going to, or before I wash another wash and go, I'm going to need to get this product like for sure. So I'm going to just tell you guys in the order in which I use these products. So I started with the pre-shampoo and then I used, oh yeah, that's like another thing. Um... Since this is a pre-shampoo, Curlbox didn't send me an actual shampoo from African Pride, so I did use a different, what did I use? 
I think I used like a Curls brand um, shampoo, which was fine, but this is not the kind of product that um, once you rinse it out, your hair is gonna like feel and look clean because um, for my hair, it still had some residue and buildup in it even after I rinsed this out. So you do need to follow this up with an actual shampoo, just so you know. All right, so next I used the Moroccan Clay and Shea Butter Heat Activated Mask. Now, I am here for like a good, good deep conditioner, especially the fact that it's heat activated because I always use heat to activate my masks. I like the fact that they mentioned that on here that this works best with heat, um, which is a given for me in any mask that I use, not just this one. Um, It smells so good. It doesn't smell like, I noticed another thing that none of these products really smell the same. Um, this one smells completely different than the um, pre-shampoo, but it smells just as good. It just smells a little different. Mm, so good. Um, so this one um, is a detox. The clay in this product is supposed to detox your hair and soften your hair. Um, I used this and put it on my hair probably for about, I think I had it on for about two hours. Um, and it, I mean, it, it worked. I didn't see any like miracle results. There is more in here, so maybe it'll just take like another try for me to really see, but this was my second time using this for the um, deep condition, and I mean, it was just like your normal deep conditioner. Nothing like really wowed me about it, um, but definitely did its job. So after deep conditioning my hair, I went in with the chocolate conditioner. Um, I'm not gonna lie, the color, it, it really throws me off. I don't really like when products are dark like this. It, I, I don't know, it just, it really threw me off. I'm like, chocolate, ew. Like, it's just chocolate and hair for me, it's, it's just not two things that I think of together. But I did use my friend Google, and I found out that chocolate is a really good element for your hair, um, dark chocolate particularly. Um, but this conditioner is supposed to nourish and restore your hair. It says that it helps to repair, um, repair and replenish moisture to natural coils and curls. Um, the smell of this, let's see. Probably my least favorite. Yeah, probably my least favorite smell. Not a bad smell, but just like, eh, it's okay. Um, the, the product itself, I think it's it's really good. Um, it did make my hair really soft, and I could tell that um, because I like to apply my conditioner with like on soaking wet hair, so I could tell that my hair really was accepting of the conditioner because it just like kind of absorbed just so quickly into my hair. So it, it worked. It's got like a really thick consistency, so I guess that's pretty good. Okay, so we're getting closer to the end. This is um, their leave-in cream. You guys, okay, so this, so what I did was I washed my hair, I, you know, deep conditioned my hair, I conditioned my hair, and then I wanted to style my hair in a protective style. So I did two French braids going down the side. Well, before applying my French braids, I put this leave-in cream in it, and I was like, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put my hair in these French braids, um, you know, after applying the leave-in cream, I'm gonna leave these braids in my hair for about two to three days, and I'm gonna see just how much moisture my hair retains with this cream. And I was not disappointed. I took, actually, these are, this is the result of taking my two French braids down, and you guys, like, when I tell you, I was taking them down and I was just feeling my hair and it just felt so moisturized. And I'm not sure if you can tell, but it's like really, it's shiny. It's definitely kept its shine. Um, and the product did a really, really good job. It's thick in consistency and I love that in a cream. It smells delicious. It's a little bit more of a subtle smell, um, but it smells awesome. This is what yeah you're gonna see that it looks like so it's it's really thick i love this this is like the perfect kind of cream for me i love thick creams i love creams that come in an easy to access jar like this so i mean this is perfect um as you can see i didn't use a lot so i don't see myself running out of this soon but if and when i do run out of this i am definitely going to repurchase this <sighs> and it smells so good because i just love it Okay guys, so this is like my absolute favorite, favorite of my Curlbox little package that I got here. 
this oil now i love a good oil i mean if you know me you know i love putting oils in my hair especially castor oil especially um argan oil i, I love oils for my hair so this oil is the um, also part of the moisture miracle line it has castor grapeseed argan coconut and olive oil Oh my god i have to always because i'm more of like what does it smell like so i always have to tell you first what it smells like and you guys it smells so so good it's got an easy to apply tube so you just apply it to your hair just like that and you can also give yourself like a nice scalp massage or something you can also take it and apply it to the um, ends of your hair to seal in moisture with your ends but you guys once i apply this oil to my scalp I literally can smell the oil for the rest of the day and I'm telling you it smells so so good definitely apply this in the morning because you're gonna get a little hint of the smell throughout the day and you're just really gonna be pleased with it and then I like to apply it on my hair at night as well before I tie my hair up definitely definitely love this oil if I let's see and it's a lot of oil actually so here is the bottle this is a uh, four fluid ounce bottle so that is a good amount of oil and here is where I'm at right here so I've probably gone a little bit overboard and I realized that my hair doesn't need this much oil in such a short amount of time that I've had this I think it's like I said been about two weeks so I probably can cool it on using as much but I just can't help it because it smells so good y'all I just really can't help myself so yeah, there is my review of the products that I received in my Curlbox package for um, the African Pride line. Um, using these products just in these short amount of time, I'm really curious to know what else African Pride has to offer. I'd be curious to know if they have like styling products, you know, like a styling, um, I don't know, like a cream or a gel or a, a twisting cream something like that I just want to know what else they have so it definitely helped me realize that this is a really really good brand and I'm definitely gonna try more of their products and you guys to be honest I was thinking like okay the $25 that I spend on Curlbox I was honestly thinking to myself like should I keep the subscription should I cancel it because you know it's $25 and I'm just like I don't know if it's worth it but when I got this box I was just like okay this was worth it because I would have never gotten African Pride you know anytime soon at least um, so I'm so happy that Curlbox does the research like they say for me and sends me the products that they already know and trust and so now I have a brand that I know um, and trust now so I can use the rest of their products all right guys that's it thank you so much for watching my review today of African Pride's products that Curlbox sent me don't forget to follow me on Instagram at TX. I'll see you guys in the next video bye